Yeah, on uh, Ukraine, uh, uh, President Zelensky's uh, chief of staff has said that the, there are talks this week uh, on uh, security guarantees in Washington. Uh, do you have anything on this? Um, sure. Um, uh, those talks are going to kick off this week. Those are an outgrowth of the statement that we released at the, that the um, G7 released uh, on the margins of the last NATO summit in Vilnius, where President Biden and G7 leaders uh, made clear that we were going to engage in negotiations with uh, the government of Ukraine about our long-term commitments to Ukraine's security um, so it can establish a military that can defend itself and deter a future attack. Uh, rebuild its economy, protect its citizens, and pursue integration into the Euro-Atlantic community. I will note this is separate and apart from the security assistance that we regularly provide now. We've made clear that we see this proceeding on two tracks. One, security assistance to support their efforts to uh, repel the Russian aggression inside their country, and two, to uh, uh, establish a long-term military that can um, uh, serve as a deterrent effect from future Russian aggression. So uh, those meetings are going to start this week. I would add that um, since we released that joint declaration uh, as the, um, uh, from the G G7 and EU uh, in Vilnius, 12 other countries have joined uh, uh, their names to the declaration. So talks will begin this week about how we can um, uh, uh, decide on the actual details of those security commitments going forward. And on the summit uh, in Saudi Arabia uh, this week uh, on Ukraine, uh, do you support this summit? Uh, who will attend it and uh, what's the goal of it? Um, we do, of course, um, uh, support this summit. We have long said um, that it is important that Ukraine be in the driver's seat when it comes to any potential diplomatic resolution. Uh, to this war. Um, it's important that countries that have not yet heard directly from Ukraine hear from Ukraine. So we are gratified that there will be countries that will be attending this summit to um, uh, talk directly with Ukraine. If your question was with respect to what other countries will be attending, I would defer to the governments of Saudi Arabia and Ukraine to, that, to, that, to answer that question. If the question is respect. I'm coming. I'm coming to you. You don't have to. If the, you don't have to jump in, if the question is with respect to um, uh, what U.S. government yes. officials will be attending, I can confirm that there will be U.S. government officials not ready to make announcements yet about who those those will be. But as the week goes on, um, certainly you can expect that that we will do so.